Hey guys, this is a review on my Dell Latitude C810. So, this will have some bad comments in it. So, because the computer is, well, it's crap. It's 11 years old and I think it could do better, but it won't. So, let's get started. Like, Opening it up. The screen would come on. There we go. Oh my god. Um, we'll bring up the specifications because I, for some reason right now it, it's two two fifty four a.m. in the morning and uh, my brain's not working right, so I gotta bring them up. This computer, um, it's been through a lot. It, it, it's previously a, uh, a school laptop that my school, the Greene County Career Center, used. And uh, they gave it to me. I was going to give it to my brother, but it turned out to have way too much problems. So I said, you know, the heck with it. I'll just use it until it runs into the ground and goes up in smoke and flames. You know, why not? Okay. It's running Windows XP, Home Edition, Service Pack 3, Intel Pentium R3 mobile CPU, 1.13 gigahertz of 200 mi And this right here is what I hate. Is the, the I like the good processor, but I hate the very small amount of RAM. That is just so freaking gay in so many ways I don't understand it though the, the computer can only support up to 512 megabytes um, <clears throat> it has a DVD drive in the front well my Xbox is in the way uh, I don't feel like moving that so it has a DVD drive in the side it also has uh, S video um, something right here I don't know what that is uh, damn good speakers I, if I have anything good to say about this laptop it's the speakers I, I absolutely love the speakers on this um, it does not have built in Wi-Fi but that is a Wi-Fi card uh, two wire um, portability not available this is where the battery goes and it's kind of gone I took it out because even with the battery it would not charge uh, let's go around to the back here you have got all the standard ports VGA dual fans which is nice it still gets very hot because the fans don't want to ever kick on two USB um right there I don't know if you can see it is where the hard drive goes as LAN and phone line uh it has a trackpad and a touchpad, which has been nice. I have no clue what this little eye here does. I press it and nothing happens. Probably something that happened before. Um, it does not support Windows 7. It probably could with more RAM. That's just a little sticker I put on there for the hell of it. Why not? Uh, recently replaced screen, um, the old screen I had on it, uh, I let, I left it on all night and it got too hot and the screen stopped working for, it still worked, it just flickered on and off whenever it wanted to. This screen's good, but the resolution's a little fucked up on it, like I'll, uh, bring up iTunes. I go and do a review on this thing and it's lightning fast. That pisses me off. 
I went to play a video on it for YouTube earlier and it it literally took 50 minutes for the goddamn thing to load and it, it's like god damn it Ugh, pisses me off well iTunes is taking its sweet old time don't know why enjoy the background while you're waiting I would pause the video and do like a jump cut but the iPod I'm using an iPod touch to upload this video and it kind of does not do a good job of pausing the video so you know just no nah, that won't work There is a little, a, oh, yeah, there it is, it's kind of, I don't know what that is, I, it's kind of been, I mean, the old screen didn't have all these little marks or anything in them, they were actually pretty decent, but like I said, the screen didn't work, so, well, I'm getting up to six minutes, and I can't really show you any more to it. Quick fact though, this is the Dell Latitude C810, released February of 2002, you can look it up, and it was discontinued in 2003, but it was recontinued in 2005 as the Dell Latitude D810, which had some major improvements, because this one supposedly had so much defectiveness and oh actually the resolution is doing pretty good right now so we'll need to worry about that but if you want to see more reviews uh subscribe and catch you later